Sorry for you. Hi, I have a pickup for Jesse. Sounds good. You can pull forward. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you so much. You too. and welcome to another weekly vlog. I'm actually starting this one on Sunday, September 1st. Happy almost Labor Day. My birthday's tomorrow, I'm turning 30. Yikes. We actually have a wedding today. I'm trying the Nutty Pumpkin drink from Dunkin'. I think it's fine. Whenever we go to Dunkin', me and Kev get some half browns to share. The man loves a potato, he got that from me. I am about 50 pages away from finishing Daydream by Hannah Grace. I read like 300 pages yesterday, so I just have a little bit left. And I love this so much. I knew I would. I knew it would be a five star. I just love her writing and everything feels so realistic, which I love. Um, this is kind of more of a slower burn in like the spicy aspect, which is totally fine. I think it's more realistic. I love the like mental health rep in here too. Both these characters deal with anxiety and a lot of the things Henry was like going through in his mind, I was like, I think like that too. Like, oh, like <laughs> I relate to how he's feeling about things and how he like puts things off because he's anxious about them. And then like he does them and it's like not a big deal, but he just, he puts it off and gives himself anxiety for no reason. Like, why do we do that? If you read Icebreaker and you thought it was okay, the first book in this series, keep going because the second book is better and this book is the best. So keep reading in the series. I liked Icebreaker. I probably gave it four stars. So I'm going to finish it this morning. So I need to go home and shower and did I say home? I'll go home. I love him so much. You want to go home? Where's dad? Should we go home and get dad? He's so sweet. Um. I need to go home and shower and finish this book. Hi, happy Monday and happy Labor Day and it's my 30th birthday today. I don't really have plans today, but I am going to take my dog Kevin to Starbucks to get a pup cup. We live in a smaller city, so I have to drive like 20 minutes to get Starbucks. So I will be driving 20 minutes just to get a free venti pumpkin cream cold brew. So. But I'm taking my dog, so that's good because we were gone at a wedding last night, so he needs some fun in his life. Are we gonna go? Do you wanna go? Get coffee? Should we go get coffee? Yeah. Now we have a 20 minute drive home. <laughs> now I'm gonna head home. And honestly, even though it's my birthday, I really need to do some chores around the house. So I think I'm gonna go home and put my audiobook on. I'm listening to Rock, Paper, Scissors by Alice Feeney, and I'm really liking it. I just haven't listened to it in a day or two because we've been busy. We might decorate for fall today, and I think I wanna start Not In Love by Allie Hazelwood. We're gonna go to... Do you have something to add? No? Okay. Happy Tuesday. I just wanted to do a quick reading update. I did start Not In Love by Allie Hazelwood last night and I got like 70 pages in and then I read another 20 on my lunch break. So I'm on page 90 and I'm really liking it. I Her writing is just really easy to read and laugh along with and it's 
enemies to lovers, workplace rival kind of thing, which I really don't read too many of. So I'm definitely excited to keep going in that. And then I think I'm about 70% of the way through Rock, Paper, Scissors. I'm not liking it as much as I liked Good Bad Girl by Elle Sweeney, but I'm enjoying listening to it and I'm gonna listen to it here on my drive home. So yeah. Lighting is not great here, but I did go get another coffee this morning. Happy Wednesday. I'm getting a lot of coffee out because it's my birthday week, but I did just buy some cold brew for home, so I'm gonna slow down. But this was free. Um, this is my free caribou drink. She talked me into the XL. Um, and then they put these cutie little stickers on it. There's like a little birthday gnome and some candles. And then this is the straw they gave me. How fun. <laughs> 